what is the difference now between this, the color displays on computers, say five years ago and now? You know, in, in sort of a general term, what's right. the evolution been? Very interesting evolution from the old cathode ray technology uh, with the CRTs. Um, very low cost solutions there. Now up through very vibrant LCDs, upwards of 30 inches in display uh, size and a very compelling price point. So we've seen a transition from CRTs being mainstream to now LCDs. In fact, you probably can't even find a new CRT anymore uh, on the Best Buy shelf, if you will. Now you guys had an announcement with DreamWorks. So tell us about the, uh, the importance of that in terms of production. Um, and, and, you know, we don't really look too closely at, you know, high-end video production, but it has implications. What, what's the importance of this new technology, perhaps, uh, both for the industry and for consumers? Sure. This, is, this has been a big challenge for production studios like DreamWorks to offer a solution that's very predictable, something that they can deploy easily in their environment, and something that is replicatable in their environment. Uh, in the past, they used the old CRT technology because when the green of Shrek was a particular color, they wanted to make sure that green that was on the CRT made it out to the same green that was in the movie uh, theater, right? So today, uh, or yesterday, we actually announced the new Dream Color Display technology. We didn't announce the product yet, but we uh, talked about a collaboration with DreamWorks that we're bringing new LCD panels with LED backlight technology that can be that consistency that they need from conception to deployment. So it's, it's a big opportunity for us, it's a big opportunity for the studios and broadcast studios here at NAB uh, to finally find a solution at a fraction of the cost that they've been paying for high-end LCD technology today.